Now we are doing exercise 4.3, question number 5. Question number 5, let me write down the question. So here is our question. Question says in a given fraction, the denominator is greater than the numerator by 2. If 7 is added to the numerator, the resulting fractions become greater than the given fraction by 1. Find the fraction. So what you are going to do? Let x be the numerator. Okay. And y be the denominator. Denominator. Okay. Now x be the numerator and y be the denominator. Now what else? The question is saying the denominator is greater than of the given fraction of the given fraction. Okay. So the denominator is greater than the numerator by 2. So given what is given is denominator that is y is greater than the numerator by 2. So you can add on x plus 2 x is numerator so y is greater than denominator so x y will be equal to x plus 2 or you can write down x to transfer that side so it will be x or you do whatever you want you just keep like that fine okay this is equation number one okay now if 7 is added to the number and if 7 is added to the numerator so if you x is numerator plus 7 okay the resulting fraction so x plus 7 denominator is y only not adding anything to denominator only to numerator adding so the previous fraction was x by y right okay so this here x by y is going to increase become greater than the given fraction by 1 so you're going to do plus 1 okay why if you add 7 to the numerator y is as it is denominator is as it is so the resulting fraction resulting fraction becomes greater than the given fraction what is given x by y right it will become greater than the given fraction by one so plus one i hope you can understand the logic so x plus seven divided by y is equal to x y we'll go there and multiply it will be x plus y divided by y y y cancel so you can write down the here else let me put the partition and write down so x plus 7 is equal to x plus y transfer this side x plus 7 minus x is equal to y x x out and y is equal to 7 okay so put y is equal to 7 in equation number 1 in 1 okay if you put y is equal to 7 in equation number 1 you are going to get y that is 7 is equal to x plus 2 or x is equal to 7 2 will come this side 7 minus 2 7 minus 2 it is 5 okay so therefore okay let me rough this one therefore the required fraction is fraction is x by y x we got it to be 5 and y is 7 am i correct x we got it to be 5 here right and y is 7 so write down x is equal to 5 and y is equal to 7 and i hope okay you are able to understand this much if you didn't please do write in the comment below i'm telling you once again please do write in the comment below i will be happy to help you that's all thank you so much we will meet in the next video